You guys like, oh, it's so in derpy, right? Well, now you guys can get them and the gang as stickers. Aren't they just precious? Check them out at the link down below. These papers really need to be filed somewhere, but I'm not entirely sure where. Some of these are Reggie's notes and some of them are Harkman's notes. So I don't know if I'm supposed to put them with their notes or if I should put them in the general notes about 5162. Because they all have to do with them, but uh, they also have their other personal notes on here. It feels weird to be looking through their personal notes. I shouldn't do that. I'll just, I'll leave that be. But we really need to clean up this office. I mean, it's not a total mess. It's just, there's a lot of papers here that shouldn't, I don't think should be here. These are interview log stuff, so we should probably put those away, too, because, uh... Well, I'll, I'll tell Dr. Harkman that we should clean that up, just in case, because... I don't know, I don't like paper being out in the open. I think... I think Davis is coming back today, or something along those lines. I don't remember the full situation. But... Everything's all ready for him, so... That's good. God, we have so much papers here, what's this? Okay, this is just reports of... Alright. Like, what he does. The schedule kind of changes up a bit, but mostly working out. But yeah. Why do we have so much- I have my notes. These are- these are- I'm keeping my stuff nice and clean. I don't know what- Like, I don't even have anything on my desk besides, you know. Everything's weird. Everything's just weird about that. There's a lot of stuff going on. I mean... That thing in the... The city that ran after me, that was fun. It wasn't really. That was... It's just so much going on. We got that weird person thing from the city. And we got the stupid fucking sun thing that's going on. It's just... I don't even know. It's a lot to be going on. Uh, hi there. Can I help you? Oh. Well, I just came in here to get a few files that I needed for the next uh, mission that I have to research for. Don't worry about it, it's fine. Uh, okay, um, are you with your parents or something, or? Oh my god, we're dealing with this all day! Okay, I'm Dr. Bright. I am temporarily within this body because our D-class has declined. So I'm using this one for now. Uh, I'm just going... Wait for Dr. Hockman to come in. He'll explain everything you need, dearie. Man, now, where the fuck are these papers? I mean, uh, okay. Hello? Hi, Dr. Hockman. Oh. Oh, Cass. Hockman! Uh, doctor. You should see uh, your face, old man. I'm Dr. confused. Bright. I'm very confused. <laughs> very confused. They always are. You don't know Dr. Bright. It's fine, not many researchers do. This <laughs> is Dr. Bright. He is an old-time researcher here at the Foundation. Old-time, just look rather, at my friends. I get that sense that it's rather contradictory, considering how he looks right now. I was now. about Why to say. a child right now? She ran out of D-class that I could use, and... This is like the first one that Amulet got on, and I was like, you know what? Th this will work. This kids works. from the bus. <laughs> you were so easy. The, okay. So, yep, yep. Dr. Bright is the, I guess, in layman's terms, it's the amulet itself. <laughs> okay. Oh, Whoever wears the amulet is Dr. Bright. Brock, Dr. Bright is the amulet. Okay. Well, it's nice to meet you, Dr. Bright. I'm sorry I was confused over that. Um, confused. Hi, don't worry. It's fine. I don't, I don't blame you. When I first saw Dr. Bright, I thought. They're a madman. Can you... <laughs> what did they do so far? What do you mean? They just came in and were looking for... They didn't do anything, did they? No, they just came in to go look at your files. They haven't even touched the files yet. Don't touch my files. <laughs> oh, come on. Just a little bit of read-up. Need to no. catch up on the situation, after all. 
So what, you can test how to screw him over? But I didn't even let him into the room. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh! you didn't even bring him in. Oh, this is going to be fun. Just standing there. Yeah, that was... Deadly sorry for that, Davis. What the hell happened to my room? <laughs> uh, I uh, upgraded your accommodations. I hope you like them. Uh, thanks. Oh, he's getting more updates. That's neat. Yeah, the uh, council... <laughs> Uh, asked for that, so... Yes, uh... <laughs> so, yes, so, why... Were you the... No. It can't be. <laughs> Guess who's newly assigned? <laughs> He's the neurosurgeon I was talking about. Oh. oh. I'm going to be here to help you. And it's going to be such a fun time. <laughs> Cat. Yeah. There is a list that you can read upon what Dr. Bright can or cannot do. You a whole list made just for me. Oh, uh, <laughs> oh, and with him, it's going to be so much more fun. I'll be looking over that list then. Yes, just keep your eye on him. Okay, I will. <laughs> it's kind of hard not to. All right, so what do you want to know right now, Dr. Bright? Uh, just current updates on the situation, and uh, him in general in the other room. 5162 has recently come back from a mission of capturing Abel. They didn't capture him, but he is dead now. Don't worry, he'll come back, like they always do. Always and forever. So far, mentally unsure. Physically capable. 5162's mm -hmm. ability, I think you already read up upon it. <laughs> it's a really interesting one. Yes, retains memories upon death and resets back to a certain point upon his awakening. Hmm. Not unlike myself, except, ah, uh, God, I wish I could have the power to manipulate time like that. No, it's I... so much easier. I think I'd be terrified at the prospects, if I'm being honest. Oh, but it'd be so much more interesting, wouldn't it? Sure. <laughs> 5162, though, is currently just relaxing. He has an implant in his head right now. I don't know if you remember that cut. Mm. Oh, yeah. That allows us to have partial control over it. I think you're being brought in to figure out how to reduce his REM sleep, though. Or at least <sighs> turn it off. Because we do need to turn it off. We figured out that it is triggered during REM. And obviously he needs to sleep at some point. I well, can't have a crazy sleepless madman when we need an important tool to be functional now. I'm assuming you don't know. You do know about the situation then. <laughs> How could I not? <laughs> okay. Um, so, is there anything I He's need to not... do? Or, uh... Well, not really. We have four computers here. Dr. Bright, the, that computer over there will be yours. Mm -hmm. This is Reggie's. That's Kat's and my over there's mine. What is Reggie uh -huh. right now? Oh, um, I think he called in, actually. Sick? Yeah. Probably just trying to spend more time with his daughter, if I'm being honest. No, I, I, I called him. He sounded really sick. Oh. Yeah. Well, but that's I, bad, then. I think uh, he mentioned We've never taken a day in my life. I feel like that's easy for you not to get sick. <laughs> well, if oh, I kind of sick, bye. <laughs> oh, Doctor, you're going to have to get used to one body at some point. If I'm being honest, you might not want to change from that one. Oh. Oh. You know, oh. Changing oh. Up those things. I know. Can't get bitches like this. <sighs> Never gone. All right. <laughs> Watch your tongue. Anyways, our job right now is just to make sure he's fine. Prepare him for another mission deployment. And that'll be it. Okay. Um, Any questions, hmm. Dr. Bright? Anything that I can answer for you? Or maybe even my associate here? Hmm, I think I'm good. Alright. Um, Cat. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Do me a favor. Um, I need you to go ahead and 
check up on 516 too, if you could. Uh, yeah, I can do that. Just make sure he's fine. I need to talk to Dr. Bright personally about some other matters. <laughs> okay, yeah, I can I can do that. I'll just uh, go check in on him. All right. Do you right. want me to do that in the interview room or actually go in? Interview room in. It doesn't match. Really I'll, I'll just go in, so that seems easier. I feel like he's right. relaxing. I'll open the door for you at the very least. Thank you. Please don't forget. Like we did it I just a few moments won't. ago. Okay. It's so really weird. Oh, and even best part, I get to talk to uh, Davis about all this. About everything. That's just fantastic. <laughs> oh, uh, hey? Hey, how's it going? Um, going fine. I mean, I didn't expect this. Yeah, well, it wasn't really too much thing. trouble. So, I hope you like it. If there's anything you want changed, let me know. Um, no, I don't, I don't, I don't think so. I mean, I got a bunch of workout equipment now and carpet. I guess that's for more floor activities. Yeah, and I thought it added some more color into the room. Yeah, and I, I didn't say anything, but the TV's now like, what, hang on the wall? Yeah, I thought, you know be better, you know, so you don't accidentally knock it over. <laughs> I'm not sure how I'd knock it over. Well, just in case. And, uh, I made sure you got a lot of workout equipment, since I know you do that often, so... Yeah, well, it's been a while since I've lifted. Well, just make sure you be safe doing it, okay? Mm. Yeah, I'll be fine. Okay. Um, Dr. Harkman sent me in to just check in on you, make sure you're okay. Oh, I thought that was just you. Uh, yeah, thanks. Oh, I also really wanted to know if you were okay. I mean, to be honest, uh, I don't usually come in here. I mean, when you're here, I mean, I know I do, but... I am panicked right now, but that's a different issue. Do you want to talk about it? I don't really know if I can with you. I mean, Harkman said he can know, but, you know... Yeah. Um. You seem frazzled yourself. Yeah, a lot of stuff's been going on. But, uh. Remember that conversation we had? Um, at the <sighs> house? Yeah. At the house. Well, um. People know about that, so <laughs> that was, uh. Just a lot of stuff's been going on, and I, I got to know more about- more information about things. Uh, what kind of things? Well, um... I'm sure I can tell you another time, because, uh, I want you to make, make sure you're relaxing right now. I am pretty much as relaxed as can be, sitting here. I guess. Yeah, I'm just not sure I if I... I could uh, try doing that whole Wii thing again, but, you know. You're not having fun with the Wii? I can get you um, something else? I, I'm, I don't, I'm just not a game kind of person like I used to be when I was a kid. Well, at least you know what games uh, Marcus is talking about now. <laughs> yeah. That's good. Oh, um, I also made sure oh. your kitchen was fully equipped, so... If you want- Yeah, I saw the- I saw the- that. You know, if you, if you want anything, like, specific, like, in specific ingredients, just let us know. Thanks. No problem. Really. It's, uh, not only my job, but, you know, like, making sure you're happy. Well, pretty fine right now. Okay. Um, if you'd like, I can just, uh, fuck off, as you call it, so I can... I don't really care if I'm being honest. Okay. Um, well, I will just leave you to it then. And if, again, if you need anything, just I'll be working. So, just right. watch out for me. 
Yeah, I, I will. Awesome. All right. Well, enjoy your space. See you. Okay, that could have been bad. I mean, I, I wasn't supposed to know what you're doing, I don't think. But, you know, the only time I kind of wanted to, because it's like, I feel I'm I mean, you know, we, we read the talk about together, so, like, that's... To wait until I'm probably not recording in the area, so that's fantastic. Great, woohoo! Okay, now I gotta deal with this whole Doctor Bright stuff and the thing and chasing me and the sun, and that's gonna be fun. I'll just get back to work then, I guess. Thank you. 